What's going on guys? Etika from the Etika World Network here and another day, another time for the Smash Ballad to progress. And in terms of new information, not much, but there was a minute change which could make a difference in the long run. Now let's go to the web browser right now and we're going to see that here in the United States, we refresh the page, the Smash Ballot is now closed. Now I know some other regions had closed their ballots from way earlier in this week. For some reason, I could still access the page by refreshing it, even though yesterday it was clearly far after the third. I don't know what the deal was with this. Maybe certain regions of the United States had access to the ballot after the fact. Either way, it's all done now, and this leads me to guess that the ballot is now closed in every single region of the world, so uh, yay. I guess this is us passing another checkpoint in the ballot itself because um there's no more votes being taken in which means that the results that are there are there permanently now we don't know anything about who's in the running of course who's in the lead and um it, that's information that i really would love to have access to but nintendo hasn't said anything nothing on their twitter so far regarding the smash ballot at all but something else that did happen however is a change on their youtube channel now i was asking you guys on twitter about this a little bit earlier probably a few minutes ago i don't even have a watch on my arm i, I just look just to give it that look that shit look cool nigga but um i asked you niggas about this shit a few minutes ago on twitter and i had actually done a video before this one talking about that mysterious private video that people were racking my brain about on Twitter and then more information more foresight was shown about it so we're going to go into the stuff that you dudes told me is um, right now because obviously you have access to more information than my ass would um, so I asked you dudes what the video was about so here was the status um, did that private video on the smash playlist only show up yesterday some people said yes but I believe it was for a private smash run video from what I heard um, from real um, real Relayet Mom, <laughs> somebody loaded the URL of a private video and found the thumbnails to just be a Smash Run commercial. Probably a mistake. No, it's an old 3DS trailer that accidentally leaked Ganondorf for Smash before it was released. I remember when that happened as well too. It was basically a confirmation for the guy, and everybody was talking about it. It was kind of like he was—I think it was Pikachu that was fighting—and you saw like the little marker of Ganondorf on the side. So that makes a lot of sense. I don't think Nintendo would be that sloppy to upload a fucking Smash Brothers new DLC character trailer this early and um, then put it on private. It makes no sense to me. But um. There were a lot of people that were getting hype about this because they were saying, okay, well, the Smash Ballad is done now. Potentially, Nintendo could have a trailer for the new DLC character up by this point. That would be only if they took the initiative a few months ago to be able to make that trailer for the character because they saw that they were in the lead already. I addressed this before. Potentially, Nintendo could have seen the ballot um, results from months ago and said, hey, these guys are in the top. They're probably going to stay in the top for the long run. Why don't we make the DLC for these guys right now? But... That would be slightly jumping the gun, or maybe not, not even slightly, that would be jumping the gun in an extreme way. We know Nintendo doesn't roll like that. They're not sloppy to that extent. They would wait for the whole thing to be done and then start working on it. So, like I said, even though I'm counting down information with this ballot, it could be a long time until we get some closure, some follow-up, some coverage on this thing. So, we have to be patient, as usual, with Daddy Sakurai. <laughs> Chrissy, what's going on, Chrissy? Um, she said, yeah, but the description, it mentioned pre-ordering the Wii U version of Smash, so maybe it was just an unreleased trailer. And um, this links in with the information that we found from Rella, who said that somebody loaded the video and found the thumbnail to be a Smash Run commercial, so that definitely sounds accurate. Um, Although she said that the description was the Wii U version of Smash. So why would the Wii U version of Smash in a trailer talk about um, Smash Run? I don't get it. But anyways, um, we are getting the new version soon. See what that means. Uh, what is this? Uh, I'll check that out later. Um, yeah, but it looks like a commercial from last year. The Fighter Ballot one? Yeah. Um, my boy, yes, it did. Um, are you going to cover the data found in this patch? Yeah, there was a lot of stuff, apparently, like a lot of placeholders for the characters. I'll definitely add my two cents on this le um, later on, but right now I did want to talk only about the ballot. Well, you did say this looked creepy, you know, add this to the mix, what the fuck? No, it was an old 3DS trailer that they must have accidentally turned private. That was proven yesterday. So, now you have your information. I could have easily just made a video hyping this up to be, you know, a new trailer for the DLC character for the Smash Ballot, but the information's coming in, and this is nothing more than just an old trailer that they privated due to the fact that it leaked Ganondorf. I don't know if this is 100% confirmed, but everyone's telling me the same thing on this, so I'm guessing the information must be true. That's horrible logic to use in life. Don't follow my example, but at this point now, there's nothing professional about what I'm doing I'm just following this as an excited fan and um, yeah there's nothing to get hype about with that private video I actually have it open right here and it looks mysterious and the thing that makes me curious about it is the fact that 
Oh, actually, it makes no sense. I was going to say, why is the video posted so late right next to the Mii Fighters, but um, the ones that were recently released? But, I mean, the videos are in messed up order anyways. Like, this is the first trailer for Smash 3DS and Wii U, and it's all the way at 9. This is not at 1. So, the order doesn't matter, um, which means there's no date applied to these things, which means that this could just be any video that was posted a while ago. Um, most likely, it's that trailer for Smash Run that revealed Ganondorf. Anyways, guys, thank you for all the information on Twitter. I do appreciate it. And if you haven't followed me on Twitter yet to be able to interact with me and give me information and um, just in general to fuck with me, a lot of people like doing that on here, um, you can go to my Twitter right here. It's Etika W Network. Get, definitely go there and give me a follow, man. I, I love having the information. I love the interaction. And I mean, I, I feel like in general, it's like a win-win for both of us. So I mean, whatever. Anyways, guys, I'll talk to you in the next video. Thank you for tuning in. Take care of yourselves, and of course, as usual, please have yourself a damn good one.